How humiliating. Lol as Meghan's political letter pushed aside by Joe Biden she is ineligible. Meghan Markle's bid to get paid family leave in the US has failed after Joe Biden dropped it from his $1.75 trillion, £1 1.27 trillion pounds, spending plan. The Duchess of Sussex wrote to members of the US Congress and Senate earlier this month calling for paid leave for new parents. However it emerged on Thursday that US President Mr Biden has not included paid family leave in his scaled-back spending plan in an attempt to push it through Congress. It was one of a series of promises missing from the spending plan. The move prompted accusations from some that the Duchess was interfering in US politics. Meghan said she was writing the letter as a mom and on behalf of millions of American families. The former actress, who is mother to Archie and Lilibet, insisted paid leave should be a national right. The US is one of just eight countries without national paid maternity leave. The former Suits star, who signed off as Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex, concluded the letter by writing, If we're going to create a new era of family-first policies, let's make sure that includes a strong paid leave program for every American that's guaranteed, accessible, and encouraged without stigma or penalty. I know how politically charged things can, and have, become. But this isn't about right or left, it's about right or wrong. Author Tom Bauer, who is writing a book about Meghan Markle, says he believes she and Prince Harry will realize they are building an isolated world for themselves due to feuds with family members. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have built an isolated world for themselves and are desperate to control the narrative, a royal author has claimed. The couple stepped down as senior royals last year and are now living in California with their two children Archie and Lilibet. Harry is seemingly at odds with both his older brother Prince William and father Prince Charles, who he accused of cutting him off financially and said he stopped taking his calls. Meanwhile, Meghan has a rocky relationship with her father Thomas, who has never met his two grandchildren. The pair have not spoken for almost four years after it emerged he staged a photo shoot with paparazzi just before her wedding to Harry. In a recent interview on Good Morning Britain, Thomas branded her childish and silly and said he would keep speaking to the media until he hears from her. And now biographer Tom Bauer, who is currently researching and writing a book about Meghan claims they are alienating their families. He told Closer magazine, Harry and Meghan have totally isolated themselves. They seem to think they will be stronger by cutting people out, but they're really just alienating their families. I think it's very sad for them both and their children. I believe Meghan is a very stubborn person, but I think eventually even she'll realize that this isolated world she and Harry have built for themselves was a poisonous choice. They seem so desperate to control the narrative that they can't risk anyone else influencing it, but this will simply cause more damage to them in the future, when their children grow up with no family around them. It was announced earlier this year that Bauer was writing a book about Meghan that he says will tell the truth. He is one of the country's most well-known biographers, having released in-depth unauthorized life stories of famous figures like Richard Branson and Boris Johnson. Bauer also isn't a stranger to writing about royal figures as he released Rebel Prince, The Power, Passion and Defiance of Prince Charles in 2018. A source previously told The Sun, this is the book Meghan will be dreading. Tom doesn't pull his punches and is terrifyingly thorough in his research. No stone will be left unturned. The announcement of his book about Meghan came just shortly after Harry revealed he would be releasing a tell-all memoir about his life next year. The memoir is set to be the definitive account of the experiences, adventures, losses, and life lessons that have helped shape him, according to publisher Penguin Random House.